Hi students, good morning to all. Great World Mathematics. Today we will discuss about cha same unit, chapter number 2, inverse trigonometric function. Already exercise number 2.1 is completed. Exercise number 2.2, question 1 to 10 is completed. So, continuous of exercise number 2.2. Take your inside the book, page number 48. Question number 11. Question number 11. Listen. Uh, find the values of each of the following. Find the values of each of the following. Tan inverse of 2 cos. 2 sin inverse 1 by 2. 2 sin inverse 1 by 2. Okay, listen. Find the value of this given question tan inverse of 2 cos of 2 sin inverse of 1 by 2. First, you find the value of sin inverse of 1 by 2. Let's x is equal to sin inverse of 1 by 2. Then sin x is equal to 1 by 2. Sin x equal to 1 by 2 is also equal to sin value. Which value 1 by 2 in sin function? So sin pi by 6. Sin pi by 6 value is 1 by 2. So sin x equal sin pi by 6. Sin x equal to sin pi by 6. Therefore x is equal to pi by 6. x equal to pi by 6. So x is equal to sin inverse of 1 by 2. Therefore, the value of sin inverse of 1 by 2 is x is sin inverse of 1 by 2. So, so x is replaced sin inverse of 1 by 2 is equal to pi by 6. Therefore, the value of the sin inverse of 1 by 2 is equal to pi by 6. Pi by 6. So this value is such this given question. So tan inverse of tan inverse of 2 cos 2 sin inverse of 1 by 2, 2 sin inverse of 1 by 2 is equal to tan inverse of 2 cos 2 sin inverse 1 by 2 is equal to pi by 6. So 2 pi by 6, 2 pi by 6. So tan inverse of 2 into cos 2 pi by 6, 2 6. So 2 by 6 is 1 by 3. So pi by 3, pi by 3. So tan inverse of 2 into, you know the value of cos pi by 3. Cos pi by 3 is 1 by 2. Cos pi by 3 is 1 by 2. So 2 into 1 by 2 is equal to 1. So tan inverse of 1. You know the value of tan inverse of 1, 1. Uh, which value is, is equal to 1? Tan pi by 4 is equal to 1. Therefore, the tan inverse of 1 is equal to pi by 4. Tan inverse of 1 equal to pi by 4. The value of the given question tan inverse of 2 cos 2 sin inverse of 1 by 2 is equal to pi by 4. This is an equal answer. Okay, very simple question. Listen. First of all, you find sin inverse of 1 by 2 value. So, you know the sin inverse of 1 by 2 value is pi by 6. This value is substitute this given question. So, tan inverse of 2 cos of 2 sin inverse of 1 by 2 is equal to tan inverse 2 cos 2 into sin inverse 1 by 2 value is pi by 6. So, 2 into pi by 6 is pi by 3. You know the value of cos pi by 3 value. So, we know that cos pi by 3 is 1 by 2. So 1 by 2 into 2 is 1. So tan inverse of 1 is equal to pi by 4. We know that tan pi by 4 value is 1. Then the tan inverse of 1 is equal to pi by 4. The required answer of given question is pi by 4. Okay? Right. The next question number 12, 13, 14, 15. These four questions are deleted portion. So next question number 16. Question number 16. Listen. Find the values of each of the expression in say 16 to 18. 
find the value of the given question sin inverse of sin 2 pi by 3 2 pi by 3 is it so sin inverse of sin 2 pi by 3 you know that the formula sin inverse of sin x is equal to x sin inverse of sin x is equal to x when x is blanks to all x is blanks to close interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 only so x are the value between the interval close interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 then the value of sin inverse of sin x is equal to x okay this intervals only where x is blanks to close interval of minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 only but a given question sin inverse of sin 2 pi by 3 so 2 pi by 3 is not blanks to this given interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 close interval of minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 so sin inverse of sin 2 pi by 3 so sin 2 pi by 3 is written in the form sin of pi plus pi by 3 pi minus pi sorry pi minus pi by 3 so 2 pi by 3 is equal to pi minus pi by 3 3 pi minus pi is equal to pi by 3 so this value 2 pi by 3 is in the form change in pi minus pi by 3 so these two values is say also equal so 2 pi by 3 is equal to pi minus pi by 3 okay right so sin inverse of sin pi minus pi by 3 sin pi minus pi by 3 you know that sin pi minus theta sin of pi minus theta is equal to sin theta here pi minus theta is less than second quotient so second quotient sin value is positive so sin of pi minus theta is equal to plus sin theta this is a formula so here sin of pi minus pi by 3 is equal to sin pi by 3 sin pi by 3 listen here the value theta value is pi by 3 is blanks to the given interval close interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 so so sin inverse of sin pi by 3 sin inverse of sin pi by 3 is equal to pi by 3 pi by 3 using this formula so therefore the value of this question sin inverse of sin 2 pi by 3 is equal to pi by 3 therefore sin inverse of sin 2 pi by 3 is equal to pi by 3 okay this is the record answer right next uh, question number 17 60 answer pi by 3 okay correct next question question number 17 listen tan inverse of tan 3 pi by 4 tan inverse of tan 3 pi by 4 listen you know the formula you know dates or tan inverse of tan x is equal to x tan inverse of tan x is equal to x when x is blanks to x is blanks to open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 only open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 okay so here tan inverse of tan 3 pi by 4 so this only 3 pi by 4 3 pi by 4 is not in the in this given interval not blanks to in given interval open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 so uh, given question tan inverse of tan 3 pi by 4 is equal to tan inverse of tan 3 pi by 4 tan 3 pi by 4 so written in the form 3 pi by 4 is pi minus pi by 4 pi minus pi by 4 let's say pi minus pi by 4 is 4 pi minus pi 3 pi 3 pi by 4 so this value 3 pi by 4 is equal to pi minus pi by 4 so 3 pi by 4 change in the form pi minus theta form you know that uh, tan pi by theta tan pi minus theta formula tan of pi minus theta is equal to here pi minus theta 
a second quadrant. So tan L is negative. So minus tan theta. Minus tan theta. So tan of pi minus theta is equal to minus tan theta. Here tan inverse of tan pi minus pi by pi by 4 is theta. So tan pi minus theta formula is minus tan theta. So minus tan pi by 4. Minus tan pi by 4. And once more form one more formula tan of minus theta or minus x is equal to minus tan theta. Tan of minus theta is equal to minus tan theta. Listen here minus tan pi by 4 tan inverse of minus tan pi by 4. This value is written in the form tan of minus pi by 4. So minus tan pi by 4 is equal to tan of minus pi by 4. Okay. You know that the tan inverse of tan x is equal to x. When x is blanks to minus pi, open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2. Listen, here this value is minus pi by 4. Minus pi by 4 is also blanks to the given interval, open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2. Therefore, tan inverse of tan minus pi by 4 is equal to minus pi by 4. Here minus pi by 4 is blanks to open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2. Okay. So, regular answer the tan inverse of tan 3 pi by 4 is equal to minus pi by 4. This is the correct answer. And also here pi by 3 is also blanks to close interval of minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2. So, this is the answer. Okay. Very simple question. First, very very important you know this formula sin of sin x when x is blanks to close interval of minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 and tan inverse of tan x is equal to x and x is blanks to open interval minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 okay right listen next question number 18 tan of sin inverse 3 by 5 tan of sin inverse 3 by 5 sin inverse 3 by 5 plus cot inverse of 3 by 2 cot inverse of 3 by 2 find the value of the given expression tan of sin inverse 3 by 5 plus cot inverse 3 by 2 listen you know the formula tan of tan inverse x is equal to x tan of tan inverse x is equal to x but here given information given question this function tan of sin inverse of 3 by 5 plus cardinus of 3 by 2. So this value is sinus of 3 by 5 plus cardinus of 3 by 2. Change the tan inverse form it. Change the form of tan inverse x form. Right. Let's alpha is equal to. Let's alpha is equal to sin inverse of 3 by 5. Alpha is equal to sin inverse of 3 by 5. Then sin alpha is equal to alpha equals sin of 3 by 5 then sin alpha is equal to 3 by 5 sin alpha is equal to 3 by 5 right listen uh, sin alpha equal to 3 by 5 then cos alpha is equal to root of 1 minus sin square alpha you know the uh, formula cos alpha is equal to square root of 1 minus sin square alpha so cos square theta is equal to 1 minus sin square theta then cos alpha is equal to root of square root of 1 minus sin square alpha substitute this value so square root of 1 minus sin square alpha this means 3 by 5 the whole square 9 by 25 9 divided by 25 is equal to square root of 1 minus 9 by 25 1 minus 9 divided by 25 is equal to 25 minus 9 25 minus 9 is equal to 16 divided by 25 so simplify this value 4 divided by 5 so cos alpha is equal to 4 by 5 cos alpha is equal to 4 by 5 then tan alpha is equal to tan alpha is equal to you know the formula sin alpha by cos alpha sin alpha by cos alpha here sin alpha value is 3 by 5 and cos alpha value is 4 by 5 so 3 divided by 5 divided by 4 by 5 5 5 cancel remaining uh, tan alpha is equal to 3 by 4 
tan alpha is equal to 3 by 4. Then alpha is equal to tan inverse of 3 by 4. Tan inverse of 3 by 4. Listen, here alpha is equal to sin inverse of 3 by 5. And also same here alpha equal to tan inverse of 3 by 4. Compare this two value. Therefore, our left hand side is equal. And also right hand side is also equal. So therefore, sin inverse of 3 by 5 is equal to tan inverse of 3 by 4. This value sin inverse of 3 by 5 is replaced with the value tan inverse of 3 by 5 is also same value. So sin inverse of 3 by 5 equal to tan inverse of 3 by 4. Right, next one, second one, cot inverse of 3 by 2. Let's beta equal to cot inverse of 3 by 2. Cot inverse of 3 by 2. Then cot beta equal to cot beta equal to plus 3 by 2. Cot beta equal to plus 3 by 2. Which implies tan beta is equal to reciprocal of this cot beta function. So 1 by 3 by 2 is equal to 2 by 3. Is equal to 2 by 3. <coughs> so beta is equal to tan inverse of 2 by 3. Tan beta is 2 by 3. Also is same. Beta equal to tan inverse of 2 by 3. Here compare these two values. This is beta equal to cot inverse of 3 by 2. And also same beta value is equal to tan inverse of 2 by 3. Here left hand side is same beta. So also right hand side is also equal. So cot inverse of 3 by 2 is equal to cot inverse of 3 by 2 is equal to tan inverse of tan inverse of 2 by 3. Tan inverse of 2 by 3. And one and use another one formula uh, tan inverse of 1 by x is equal to cot inverse of x. Cot inverse of x. So it's another one function. Same method. Beta equal to cot inverse of 3 by 2. So cot inverse of 3 by 2 is written in the form tan inverse of 2 by 3. So tan inverse of 1 by x is equal to cot inverse of x. So cot inverse of 3 by 2 is equal to tan inverse of reciprocal of this function 3 by 2. So tan inverse of 2 by 3 equal to cot inverse of 3 by 2. This formula method. Okay. So cot inverse of 3 by 2 is equal to tan inverse of 2 by 3. These two values. This is equation number 1. This is equation number 2. From 1 and 2. From 1 and 2. These two values substitute in a given question. So tan of sin inverse 3 by 5. 3 by 5. Plus cot inverse of 3 by 2. Is equal to tan of sin inverse 3 by 5 is equal to tan inverse 3 by 4 tan inverse 3 by 4 plus cot inverse 3 by 2 is equal to tan inverse of 2 by 3 tan inverse of 2 by 3 listen here tan inverse x plus tan inverse y you know the formula tan inverse x plus tan inverse y formula so tan inverse x plus tan inverse y we know that tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus x y. Okay. You know the property tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus x y. So this formula, apply this formula is equal to tan of tan inverse 3 by 4 plus tan inverse 2 by 3. Tan inverse 3 by 4 plus tan inverse 2 by 3. This is x, this is y. So tan inverse of tan inverse of x plus y 3 by 4 plus 2 by 3. 3 by 4 plus 2 by 3 divided by 1 minus 3 by 4 into 2 by 3. 3 by 4 into 2 by 3. So simplify this value. So tan of tan inverse 3 by 4 plus 2 by 3. Cross multiplication 3, 3, 9 plus 2, 4, 6, 8 divided by 4, 3, so 12. Denominator also same 12. So 12, 12 cancel. Divided by 4, 3, so 12. 12 into 1, 12 minus 3, 2, so 6. Whole divided by 3, 4, so 12. 
So numerator we have three fours are twelve. Same value, so twelve will cancel. So simplify this value. Nine plus eight divided by twelve minus six is equal to tan of tan inverse. Nine plus eight is seventeen divided by six. Seventeen divided by six. You know the formula uh, tan of tan inverse. Tan of Listen, is equal to tan of tan inverse 17 by 17 by 6 is equal to, you know the formula tan of tan inverse x is equal to x and x is blanks to r, x is blanks to r. Listen, uh, 17 by 6, so tan inverse of tan of tan of 17 by 6 is equal to 17 divided by 6. 17 divided by 6. This is the required answer. So question number 18 is equal to required answer 17 by 6. This is the correct answer. Listen. Uh, given question tan of sin was 3 by 5 plus cot inverse 3 by 2. You know the formula tan of tan inverse x is equal to x where x is blanks to r. But a given question tan of sin inverse function plus cot inverse function. So the given sin inverse and cot inverse function change in the form tan inverse of x plus tan inverse y form. So sin inverse of 3 by 5 is equal to tan inverse of 3 by 4 and also cot inverse of 3 by 2 is changed in the form tan inverse of 2 by 3. Substitute these two values in given question. We have tan of this value sin of 3 by 5 is tan of 3 by 4 and cot of 3 by 2 is tan of 2 by 3. Use this property tan of x plus tan of y is equal to tan of x plus y divided by 1 minus x y. So x is 3 by 4 and y is 2 by 3. Substitute this value, simplify. We have tan of tan of 17 by 6. Use this formula tan of tan of x equal x when x is blanks to r. Therefore, tan of tan of 17 by 6 is equal to 17 by 6. This is a required answer. Okay, very simple question. Listen, next question number 19. Question number 19. The cos inverse of cos inverse of cos 7 pi by 6. 7 pi by 6 is equal to so now the following is correct answer a 7 pi by 6 b 5 pi by 6 c pi by 3 and d pi by 6. So find the value of cos inverse of cos 7 pi by 6. Listen you know the formula uh, cos inverse of cos 6 cos inverse of cos x you know dates cos inverse of cos x is equal to x cos inverse of cos x is equal to x x is blanks to 0 comma pi x is blanks to 0 comma pi this is a principal domain 0 comma pi is a principal domain right listen so cos inverse of cos x equal x where x is blanks to 0 comma pi x is blanks to 0 comma pi Given question cos inverse of cos 7 pi by 6. Cos 7 pi by 6. Listen, this value is 7 pi by 6. It changes the degree measure. Uh, pi by 6 is equal to 30 degree. Then 7 pi by 6 is equal to 7 into 30 to 10 degree. To 110 degree. This value is 7 pi by 6 not blanks to the given interval. Close interval 0 comma pi. 0 comma pi means 0 to 180 degree only. 0 to 180 degree. Okay, right. But here 7 pi by 6 is not blanks to since 7 pi by 6 is not blanks to close interval of 0 comma pi. Close interval of 0 comma pi. So simplify this value is equal to cos inverse of cos inverse of cos 7 pi by 6 is written in the form 7 pi by 6 pi plus 
5 by 6. Pi plus 5 by 6. Listen, pi plus 5 by 6 means 6 pi plus pi 7 pi by 6. Cross multiplication. So 7 pi by 6 is equal to pi plus pi by 6. 7 pi by 6 is equal to pi plus pi by 6. Okay, right. Listen, so cos inverse of cos inverse of pi plus pi by 6. Pi plus pi by 6 is third quartile. So you know the formula uh, cos of pi plus theta is equal to minus cos theta. This value pi plus theta is less than third quartile. So cos is negative. So minus cos theta. Cos of pi plus theta formula is minus cos theta. Here cos of pi plus pi by 6 is minus cos pi by 6. Minus cos pi by 6. You know the uh, cos of minus x is equal to plus cos x. But here uh, given a uh, minus cos pi by 6. Uh, minus cos pi by 6. So minus cos pi by 6 is written in is a cos inverse of minus cos pi by 6 is equal to cos of pi minus pi by 6. Cos of pi minus pi by 6. Why sir? So listen cos of pi minus pi by 6 is equal to minus cos pi by 6. That is cos of pi minus theta is equal to minus cos theta same. Cos of pi minus theta is equal to minus cos theta. Why is that? Here my pi minus theta is lies in second quartile. So cos theta is negative. Cos theta is negative in second quartile and also third quartile. So cos pi plus theta is minus cos theta and also same cos pi minus theta is equal to minus cos theta. Here cos of minus cos pi by 6. So minus cos pi by 6 is written in the form cos of pi minus theta. So cos of pi minus pi by 6 is equal to minus cos pi by 6. Okay, right. Listen, cos inverse of cos pi minus pi by 6. Cross multiplication. So 6 pi minus pi. 5 pi by 6. 6, 6 into 1 pi is equal to 6 pi minus 1 pi is 5 pi by 6. Listen, cos inverse of cos 5 pi by 6 is equal to 5 pi by 6. Why is that? Here uh, we know that the formula cos inverse of cos x is equal to x when the x value is between 0, pi. Listen, this value pi into pi by 6, pi into pi by 6 is equal to 150 degree, pi, pi into 30 degree. That is 150 degree. So 150 degree is blank to this given interval close interval 0, pi. That is 0, 180 degree. So uh, this value 5 pi by 6 is blanks to close interval 0, pi. Therefore, the value of this question cos inverse of cos 7 pi by 6 is equal to 5 pi by 6. So therefore, the correct answer is second option B. Option B, 5 pi by 6. Very simple. This question is very easy. But you know this formula cos inverse of cos x equal to x when x is blank to close interval this value 0 comma pi only. But given from a 7 pi by 6 not blank to this given interval. Here 7 pi by 6 is not blank to close interval 0 comma pi. Therefore, so this value is not applicable this formula. So this value 7 pi by 6 change in the another one form. So pi plus pi by 6 form it. So cos pi plus theta formula is minus cos theta minus cos pi by 6. So minus cos pi by 6 is written in the form cos of pi minus theta formula. So cos inverse of cos pi minus pi by 6. Simplify this value. Pi minus pi by 6 is equal to 5 pi by 6. So 5 pi by 6 is blanks to the interval 0 comma pi close interval. So the required answer is 5 pi by 6. Very very easy question. Okay. Right. <coughs> Listen. Next question number 20. Sine, sine of pi by 3 minus sine inverse of minus 1 by 2. Sine inverse of minus 1 by 2 is equal to which one of the following is correct answer of option number A 1 by 2, B 1 by 3, C 1 by 4 and D 1. So first find the 
the value of sin of pi by 3 minus sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 listen let's x equal to sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 x equal to sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 so sin x is equal to sin sorry minus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 you know the answer 1 by 2 is equal to sin pi by 6 so, so sin x equal minus 1 by 2 is also equal to minus sin pi by 6 we know that the sin pi by 6 value is 1 by 2 then minus 1 by 2 is equal to minus sin pi by 6 so sin x is equal to minus sin pi by 6 so minus sin pi by 6 we know that the formula uh, sin of minus theta is equal to minus sin theta so this value minus sin pi by 6 is equal to sin of minus pi by 6 sin of minus pi by 6 so x is equal to minus pi by 6 x equal to minus pi by 6 this value is blanks to close to minus pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 okay so the sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 is equal to minus pi by 6 substitute this value listen uh, sin of pi by 3 minus sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 is equal to sin of pi by 3 minus sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 is equal to minus pi by 6 here x is sin inverse of minus 1. therefore uh, sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 x is replaced sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 so sin inverse of minus 1 by 2 is equal to minus pi by 6 so <coughs> This value minus pi by 6 substitute here sin inverse of minus 1 by 2. So minus of minus pi by 6. Minus of here given minus and sin of minus 1 by 2 value is minus pi by 6. So minus of minus pi by 6. So sin pi by 3 minus of minus pi by 6 plus pi by 6. So sin of here pi by 3 plus pi by 6. Take LCM 6. So 2 pi plus pi 2 pi plus pi is equal to sin 3 pi by 6 3 pi by 6 is equal to sin 3 6 cancel pi by 2 so sin pi by 2 sin pi by 2 so the value of the given question sin pi by 3 minus sinus of minus 1 by 2 is equal to sin pi by 2 sin pi by 2 value is 1 so 1 sin pi by 2 value is 1 the value of the given question sin of pi by 3 minus sin of minus 1 by 2 is equal to 1 so answer option number d 1 this is a correct answer okay listen important formula x equal to sin of x when x is plus 2 my close interval of minus pi by 6 pi by 2 comma plus pi by 2 so the x value is minus pi by 6 here sin of minus 1 by 2 value is minus pi by 6 so substitute this value simplify this so sin 3 pi by 6 is equal sin pi by 2 you know that uh, sin pi by 2 value is 1 so the given question answer is 1 okay Five. next uh, question number 21 question number 21 Listen, a given question number 21. This is the last one question. A tan inverse of root 3, tan inverse of root 3 minus cot inverse of minus root 3 is equal to a given option A pi and option B minus pi by 2, option C 0. Option D, 2 root 3. Option D, 2 root 3. Right. Listen. You know that uh, tan, tan inverse x by the property, 
tan s x minus tan s y formula. You know that? We know that tan inverse of x minus tan s of y is equal to tan s of x minus y divided by 1 minus x y divided by 1 minus x y. So change this format tan s x minus tan s y. Here cotinus of minus root 3. Cotinus of minus root 3. Listen. Let's x equal to cotinus of minus root 3 x equal to cotinus of minus root 3. So, x equal to cotinus of minus so then cot x is equal to minus root 3, cot x equal to minus root 3. We know that uh, root 3 is equal to cot pi by 6, cot pi by 6 is equal to root 3, but minus root 3 is equal to minus cot pi by 6, minus cot pi by 6. So, cot x is equal to minus cot pi by 6. So, minus cot pi by 6, we know that the formula cot of minus x is equal to minus cot x. Cot of minus x is equal to minus cot x. So, minus cot x is written in the form cot of minus x. So, this value minus cot pi by 6 is equal to cot of minus pi by 6. Cot of minus pi by 6. But cot x equal cot minus pi by 6. Here x is equal to minus pi by 6. Where the principal domain is open interval 0 comma pi. Open interval 0 comma pi. This value minus pi by 6 is not blanks to. Since minus pi by 6 is not blanks to open interval 0 comma pi. Open interval 0 comma pi. So this value, <coughs> this form is cot x is equal to cot x equal to cot of minus pi by 6 is change in the form cot of 2 pi minus theta form 2 pi minus pi by 6 so minus pi by 6 is equal to cot 2 pi minus theta is equal to cot of 2 pi minus theta is equal to or pi minus theta formula, 2 pi minus theta formula. Cot of 2 pi minus theta is equal to minus cot theta. Minus cot theta. Okay. Cot of 2 pi minus theta equal minus cot theta. And another one formula, cot of pi minus theta is also equal to minus cot pi. Minus cot pi. So 2 pi minus pi by 6. Listen. 2 pi minus pi by 6 is equal to 6 to so 12, 12 minus 1, 11 pi by 6. Listen, this value 11 pi by 6 is not blanks to this given interval, open interval 0 comma pi. So use this one formula only. Cot of pi minus theta. So cot of 2 pi minus theta is equal to minus cot theta. Here theta value is not blanks to open interval 0 comma pi. So use this formula mates. Cos 180 minus theta format. So, cot of minus pi by 6 is equal to cot pi minus pi by 6. Cot pi minus pi by 6. The formula is cot pi minus theta is equal to minus cot theta. Minus cot theta. So, cot of minus pi by 6 is equal to cot pi minus pi by 6. Listen, here x equal to pi minus pi by 6. So, pi minus pi by 6 is is equal to 6, mi 6 pi minus pi that is 5 pi by 6 5 pi by 6 5 pi by 6 means 5 into 30 degree 5 into 30 degree 5 into 30 degree is 150 degree so 150 degree is blanks to the given interval open interval 0 comma pi therefore this value 5 pi by 6 is blanks to open interval 0 comma pi so therefore the value x equal to 5 pi by 6 pi pi by 6. So use this value cotinus of minus root 3 is equal to pi pi by 6. And tanus of root 3. Tanus of uh, root 3 is equal to let y. Tanus of root 3 equal to y. And tan y is equal to uh, root 3. Tan y equal to root 3. We know that root 3 is equal to tan pi by 3. Therefore y is equal to pi by 3. Which implies tanus of root 3 is equal to pi by 3. 
ओके राइट डायरेक्ट आप इस इंद फॉर्मूले इस पर नहीं इंद फॉर्मूले तय वेल ना मगे इंद फॉर्मेट में ना इंद कुछ टैन फॉर्मेट चेंज पर इंद फॉर्मूले इस पर नहीं सही ला इल्ल अब डी ना डायरेक्ट आंसर हो टैन ऑफ़ सर रूट थ्री वैल्यू फाइव बी इतने सब्सट्रूट बनी आंसर फाइव मिलते सो लेसेन गिवन क्वेश्चन माइनस रूट थ्री इज इक्वल टू फाइव पाई बाई सिक्स दिस इज अ कॉट इन ऑफ माइनस रूट थ्री वैल्यू इक्वल टू फाइव पाई बाई सिक्स सो सब्सट्रू दिस वैल्यू फाइव माइनस थ्री माइनस फाइव पाई बाई सिक्स टेक एलसीएम सो सिक्स टू पाई माइनस फाइव पाई टू पाई माइनस फाइव पाई इज इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री पाई बाई सिक्स इज इक्वल टू माइनस फाइव बाई टू Therefore, the value of this given cosine tan inverse of root three minus cot inverse of minus root three is equal to minus pi by two. This is the correct one answer. Listen, option second option. So the answer twenty two first question option second option B is correct one answer. So answer B is minus pi by two. This is the correct one answer. Okay. Right. First, you find cot inverse of minus root three value. Listen carefully. Here, minus pi by six, not blank to zero comma pi. Okay. So, <coughs> minus pi by six change in the pi minus theta form. Pi minus pi by six is equal to pi pi by six. This value is blank to what part of zero comma pi? Okay. Wow. Pi by six minus pi by six. I use for number one. Wrong answer. That correct. Because minus pi by six in the blank interval is not. You can tell the negative part of it. ये तो नहीं है मिस्टेक पन्ना कोड़ी है इम्पोर्टेंट प्लेस नोट पन्ने चिकन केवा इधर तो अंदर मिस्टेक पन्ने रखूँगा केवा इस वैल्यू माइनस पाइ बी सिक्स नॉट ब्लैंक्स तू ऑपरेटर जरा कम अपाई अब इधर नहीं आता सर्वर केवा राइट सो एक्साइज नंबर ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट टू इस कंप्लीट सो एक्साइज नंबर ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट टू इस कंप्लीट सो एक्साइज नंबर ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट टू इस कंप्लीट नेक्स्ट मिजुलिनियस एग्जांपल्स सो मिजुलिनियस एग्जांपल्स इन नेक्स्ट क्लास ओके बाय